Hey loves, welcome back to another video. If you are new here, I am Sharni and today we're going to be getting into this blonde, a highlighted curly wig from You Nice Hair and we're going to be doing a glueless install today. So let's get into it. These are all the goodies that came into the package. Of course, the usual like your headband, your lashes, your stocking cap and they also sent your girl a robe. I love that because I never received a robe from my hair company before so that stood out to me the most. So you know I had to put it on for the video so i love how the lace was super thin i love how the knots already came pretty much bleach and the hairline was customized so this wig is literally ready to go y'all i am molding down my edges and i did let my edges sit while i did my makeup i'm putting on that stocking cap and i'm not going to mold it down because we don't need to do that so we're going to take the makeup brush that it came with i did not like this makeup brush because it wasn't sturdy enough for me so i ended up using my own makeup brush to apply my foundation powder on the lace and on the stocking cap so we're going to put the wig on and as you can see it's a laid on my forehead perfectly y'all like it literally sits on there so good this is without any glue and you really don't need the glue but if you want that extra security go for it so i'm taking the headband so i can just finish customizing the wig without it sliding and moving too much so i just secured it with the headband i'm taking my wax stick and my hot comb and we're going to get the top of that flat because we don't want that bulky wiggy look so that is what i'm doing and then i'm also going to go in and spray the hair because the curls were tight i like i love first of all i love the hair color this is giving beyonce it's giving early early 2000s beyonce the blonde the curls like it's really a vibe this is such a pretty unit i love the color i love the texture it's really soft and I don't know, I just know that this is going to be like one of my favorite grab and go wigs, okay? Something that I need real quick, real cute, you know, touch it up or whatever. But um, I'm spraying it with some water and I took like my shimmer shine spray to add that shine and softness to the hair. This is like my favorite combo. If you know, you know, if you watch my last hair tutorial i mentioned this two combo like the shimmer shine and the water and that's all you need you can also use mousse but this method has been working for me perfectly and i'm kind of like finger combing through the curls just a little bit just to kind of give that hair like i like big hair so it was kind of too flat for me so i'm trying to like you know puff the curls out a little bit and play to play around with it a little bit until it's to my liking and yeah overall y'all this hair is a 10 out of a 10 i'm also going to show y'all how it looks on the side if you decide to do a side part so yeah so you know we got to create that part i could not see the part because the lace literally blends in with the hair so i did take some concealer to kind of just create that part illusion and it came out really good it looks really really good you want to use a concealer that's you know at least two shades lighter than your skin tone you don't want to use anything too too bright but you don't want it to be too dark as well uh i'm just so in love with this hair y'all look at that blonde like this is my this is this is my new go-to wig like it's just so pretty and the hair is so soft i love a good curly wig i live for a good curly wig and i could just tell this is gonna be one of my favorite units i've been so into like the glueless installs lately I've been so into that because it's literally so convenient and I don't like to always sleep with wigs on. So this has literally been like my go-to routine. And girl, this is it. This is how it looks. It looks so pretty. I kind of finger comb the curls out a little bit, but it was still giving, it was just still giving what it needs to give. I did go in and pluck that part a little bit. And this is how it looks when I kind of finger comb the curls some more because i wanted to give it like that big look and this is kind of like before okay but overall i love both looks it looks so good i'm also going to show y'all how it looks on the side if you want to do a side part you got the cone method baby this is glueless and it looks so good like it's glued down on there y'all it's giving fine ass 
wifey. It's the pink robe for me. Ah, I live. Okay, so we're gonna do the side part real quick. All I did was just a comb it to the side, create my part. I slipped it down with my hot comb and yeah, the water and the shimmer shine method. And the side part was given, y'all. Let me know which one was given. I don't know. I think if I had to say, I honestly did like the middle part. I'm a middle part girl, but the side part was eating too. The side part was giving and I did make the hair bigger because if I'm going to do a side part, we got to have big hair. But yeah, this is the final look. Let's give it up for this hair, y'all. Like, uh, check down below in my description box for all the hair details. I am so in love. It's definitely giving what it needs to give. So y'all, leave some comments down below. Let me know what y'all think thanks subscribe if you made it all the way through love y'all so much and i'm gonna see y'all in my next video Baby, it's